Hello everybody and welcome back to the quest. I noticed that I didn't have the cursor enabled, so sorry about that. Hopefully it's there now. If it's not, uh, then I'm, I'm very sorry. And I just realized I could do this. I did not even realize. Wait, no, that's not what That one. Yeah, all right. That's so cool. X is switch. Yay. Probably gonna learn that from the menu, but I don't read menus. Just kidding, I do. Hello, that looks poisonous. Let's not drink it. You have found a book of essentials of the Amazon arts. Essentials of the Amazon arts book. Teaches accuracy plus five. Nice. You will learn to strike with your bow and arrow of throwing power with the agility of an eagle. The magic breath of the old gods will guide your hand like it happened to Aluri when she struck the heart of the evil one. The warriors who face you will shrivel beneath the swift rain of your arrows. Yay! I love how there's a little story with every skill book. Hello there, Amazon queen. Oh, hi there, Amazon guard. Who do you think you are, male? How dare you speak to me? Okay, uh, right? I guess I'll just stand on this really obvious trap then. Ow. Okay. Really? Okay. Resist poison! Cool. Um, hi. Greetings, brave hero. Be welcome to my empire. What would such an adventurer like you want here? I came for the farmer. Oh dear, not so fast. Just think about the situation we have here. You and me, male and female, hero and heroine together. Far from all the world's noise, don't you think we could do more enjoyable things than searching for some farmer? Just look at me, admire the strong, lithe, sleek body. It's yours. We could spend a whole night together if you want. Battle hardened as I am, my skin would feel like velvet, hot velvet, as I sat next to you, telling you tales of my ancestors. And you might tell me a bit of your interesting past. Also, a warrior such as yourself might like to see, might lust to see and feel my armor collection. The workmanship will dazzle you. Let's forget about that farmer and give each other what we have. It's been such a long time since I saw a brave, muscular male like you. I'll let you be my king. For this night, and you'll never come back to ask about him again. Alright, I'm in, dear. No. I came for the farmer and I'll get him. Push back that little thingy on your thighs. We can... We can talk in this way too, stranger. Then feel the sweet surface of our weapons. Rawr! Okay. Let us, um... Burning hands. She's not so tough. Okay, maybe she is a little tough. Uh, I don't know... Oh, yeah, I brought... I bought... Magic missile! I was gonna say, I, th I thought I bought the shield spell for some reason, but now I didn't. Alright, let's go ahead and heal up. Cure light wounds. And smack. And smack. Smack. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Alright, burning hands. Here we go. Ow, I'm poisoned, that's not so good. Heal. <laughs> but it's fine, because I have cure poison. Not sure if it's a good idea to use it right now, but you know. Let's use uh, restore mana. Cure light wounds again. And do we have enough for burning hands? No, we don't. Okay, uh, more mana, please. Okay, burning hands. There we go. Kill her. Yes. And now just you, Missy. Just you. Yes. That's so much easier. I love it. Okay. Um, unfortunately, I have to walk on this trap to get the stuff. So that's unfortunate, but whatever. Elven arrows and wand of weak unlock. Oh, nice. That's going to be handy. 
I'll just walk on the trap again, shall I? A storeroom key, lots of gold, scroll of shield, scroll of resist magic, bronze gauntlets, and more elven arrows. Great! Okay, I think we win! Hooray, hurrah! Let's loot the place. I already looted that. You have lost a storeroom key. All right, that's fine. But just in case there's any traps. Oh, dang it. Okay, fine. An item key. Oh, that must be where, from where he is. Infection arrows. Infects war disease. <laughs> Rogue bow. Ooh, check that out. That is sexy. Okay, and poison arrows. Nice. And scale mail. Can't use that. We can sell it, though. Jeweled amulet. Oh, my God, that's good. That is so good. And a new shield. Wow, upgrades galore. Love it. All right, so we can't, these are both heavy armor. We're not gonna be using those. We're definitely gonna equip that. And um, I suppose we'll equip, we'll definitely equip the bow. Oh no, wait, I need to go to secondary. Then equip the bow, nice. And then for, damn it. That will be let's shoot, four. Okay, can't wait to go shopping. Gonna buy some good stuff, man. <clears throat> All right. Hello, sir. Old farmer. I don't want to steal from you. I want to talk to you. Your daughter sent me. At last, thank you for freeing me. My daughter always took good care of me. I'll go home immediately. Why did they capture you? It's all about my books. Their shaman who made the poisons for their arrows died a few days ago. They took me in hopes that I'd teach them a recipe for a deadly snake venom extract that would make their arrows a thousand times more deadly. I had written a book on the subject, which is why they ransacked my huts, but this book was carefully hidden in a hole outside my hut. I'll give you a copy if you'd like to have one if you visit me in my house in a few days, but now I must go to my daughter. See you soon. Your fame has increased. Nadia's potion has been solved. Okay, good. That's fine. We solved that. Anything else in these pots? Aha, uh -huh, wand of shields. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> that would have been funny if I died from that. Okay, that's good. I think I looted everything else. All right, we're gonna go ahead and rest here. Yes. Hurrah. So, it looks like there might be something there. Is there? No, that's just where I came in. That's a poison well. Don't really want to mess with that. I didn't see anything else secrety, really. So you can see the world map here, by the way. I like how you can tell what stuff is. It's nice. All right. Well, I suppose let's go. We're done. And it's nighttime, of course. Hello, Missy. Feast on my new bow. I'm not close enough to see your HP. There we go. It doesn't do a ton more damage. She is an archer, though. She's not a, a tiny archer. A young archer. Please select a quiver. Okay. I think we should use up our cheap arrows and stuff first. Especially for just for these, like, rubbish... Uh, who's gonna call her a monster? You know. You know what I mean. Alright, it is daytime. More cheap arrows, thanks so much. for the cheap arrows. I still feel like I'm in combat. Am I in combat? Where am I right now? All right, so that's the Amazon hole. Amazon hole. <laughs> that is where that is. And, um... I suppose... Yeah, we're definitely in combat. Who is... Who goes there? Ah! Bring it. Kick it kicking this... Her butt. Way faster. Yay! Level four! So good. And weak disarm. That's something to sell. All right, so we're. This is a new area. This is like a forest. I don't know if I want to go in here quite yet. 
does it say what this is? This is the robber forest. Okay, that's where the other quest is. I suppose I could do that quick. I feel it, I'm relatively powerful. Oh, hi there. Didn't see you there. Sorry about that. Didn't mean to ignore you, you know. Would you like a burning hands? I thought you might. Alright. Fire mushrooms. These are probably good for something. Something delightful. Dang it. Pick the freaking mushroom. Oh, there's another evil guy there. Bow. Ooh, highway man. Okay. This guy's a little tougher. Burn his hands. Oh. Hey there. You're dead. You're dead. Ow. Quit it. Your dual wielding daggers will not save you, Mr. Outlaw. All right, 60 gold. I see a man over there. Yeah, this is a man. Interesting, save. A man and a hole. Hello? Uh, hello, evil man. Need to heal myself. And I'm gonna just burning hands you to speed this along. Sounds good to me. Okay. Now, what have you to say? What's your problem? You've wandered into the community of thieves, stranger. Normally you should be worried about your life, but something unusual has happened. Mysterious lights have been shining in the forest near this hole in the ground at night, and puddles in the area now have been running with blood for weeks. When someone goes to investigate this hole, which was our safe storeroom before, they're never seen again. I myself had attempted to find out what was going on, but what I saw was so disturbing I didn't venture further. When I went down below and opened a door, I saw the bodies of some of my brother thieves hanging upside down in piles of bones. Such a bloody sight should not be deserving, disturbing to a robber. Maybe you're right, but... But I also saw a mysterious ancient figure that seemed to beckon to me. I felt my blood shiver and freeze as I watched the figure undulate and seemed to approach me, and, and I ran out of there. A thief should be ashamed to admit fear, but I'm desperate. You look like a brave adventurer, so you must help. You must find out what terrible creatures have decided to make their home in this part of the forest, where no such activity has ever been before, and where most are afraid to set foot because of the fierce reputation of the robbers. Such an evil may... Such an evil may well be a threat to others beyond this forest. In return for solving the mystery, I'll take you to the robber leader who will reward you, I promise. Alright, fine. Thank you for that, stranger. I'm not sure in a reverse situation I would do the same. Take this key as proof of my confidence. It opens a room down there which has some useful rob stuff for you. So, about the leader, go and follow this pathway to the north and knock three times in the middle hut store. He'll open it if you say Duran sent you, I'm sure. But now I must go. I can't be here anymore. I'm too sick. I'm too scared. Good luck. Okay. A new quest to go down here. What is disturbing the forest? I'm going to save over this game. Yes. Lawrence is the new reigning champion. All right. We're going to go down and rest. We could rest inside um, or outside in the rain. But when you do that, it doesn't actually allow you to rest all the way. Oh, but we might have to actually anyways. Dang it. All right, outlaw territory. Hello. Are you going to be super annoying? Because that will be unfortunate. All right, burning hands it is. Okay. You guys are a no big deal. No big deal. Okay. Uh, cancel. It's trapped. Advanced storeroom. Okay. Ah, okay. That's the free one. The free key! Hello there, sirs! I think I'm going to cast 
burning hands a couple times here. Unfortunately, the other guy ran away. And I have to hit the person over there. And X. There we go. Uh, out of quiver again. There we go. There we go. Ooh, he dropped a book. Yes! And cure poison. I already have that, but it's okay. I'll sell it. Tis okay. Storeroom. Hello? Hopefully I can rest in here. Yes. Good. Okay. What do we got? Blessed Rapier. Requires good alignment. Outfit fashionable. Two damage to undead. Okay. I think I'm a good alignment still, aren't I? Apparently so, but it's the wrong weapon. Here we go. Nice. Beautiful upgrades. What do we got here? Spell Book of Curse, lots of gold coins. Creature in the cave. Padded leather armor. The enchanted knife, which we already read. Maiden steps in the alchemical arts. Is that the same book that I have already? Spell and create food. Okay. So, you know, good haul there. Ooh, another one. Resist poison. Okay, times two. Right, let's go over what we found here. Um, let's see, four armor, good, perfect. I'll only wear that one instead. And uh, that looks good. Here we go, here we go. Spell Book of Resist Poison. You don't know the spell. Ah, Stone Skin, yes! Book of Stone Skin, great, that's what I wanted. Resist Poison. Curse. Ooh, all kinds of spells. Cure poison, I already know. Your story. Chanted knife, we already read. Creature in the cave. It was a night. It was night, and I had wandered away from my companions, curiously following the ever windling, mazy, ever winding, mazy paths of a huge, majestic cave. Now every way I turned looked the same. I began to think. I'd never see daylight in home again. If I could not find a way out, this would be my tomb. Yet I could not despair. I was of the warrior class, and still hopeful my companions would find me. <laughs> that sounds so weird. My torch sputtered. As I stood in the flickering lights, I started to shout, hoping to attract attention. I thought I heard footsteps nearby. Was I about to be rescued? To my horror, however, the footsteps did not sound human. They were soft, stealthy steps, like the paws of a huge four-footed beast. My shouts must have attracted a wild creature that had wandered in the cave. I determined not to be easy prey. The warrior within me was aroused. I stood very quiet, hoping to, the beast would pass me by, but still the footsteps came closer. I groped for my weapon in the dark. In the other hand, I picked up a huge rock. I wondered what kind of animal was ready to pounce. It may have been delirious when my, with the scent of human flesh, after living on a thin diet of bats, rats, and other cave creatures. My body was tense with fright. My torch went out. Nearer, nearer, the terrible... Footfalls came. I could hear the hard breathing of an animal. I threw the rock in my hand with the utmost force and must have struck home, for I heard a heavy thump. I was overpowered with relief and collapsed back against the wall. I grabbed another stone and threw them in the same directions. Then I heard a series of clinking metallic sounds. It was my companions. They had found me, and soon the cave was lit up by their torches. I told them the story of the beast, and we went to examine the body. It looked like a great, thin ape with snow-white hair. Long claws extended from the tips of the fingers and toes. It had no tail. The creature moaned. One of my friends drew his sword to finish the monster off. With a jerk, the white body rolled over so that we could see its face. For a moment, we were struck by the eyes. One was like a cat's, the other human. As I looked closer, the thing spoke some words in a strange but human tongue and died. The creature we had killed was a man, lost like I was, perhaps for years. The fear that had flooded me left and awe, horror, and sadness came in its place. Oh boy, that's sad. Alright, what about this? I've already read the book. Primary Contagion, Made in Steps in the Alchemical Art. Yay! Your skill in identifying and mixing magical ingredients will improve, resulting in potions so powerful that you may be able to dispatch your opponents into the netherworld with ease, or you can simply brew, brew a delicious ale. Yeah! Woohoo! I've already read, already read. Okay. Looks like that's up. That's it for that. I guess we can see if we can make any potions. 
How about some mana? I used a few. Store health, mana. There we go. So we can make a total of three of these. Wouldn't mind some health as well. How about a cure ward disease? Dang it. Healing. Healing. Cure plague disease. Yay. Just our mana. Good. Anything else? Unknown. Okay. Alright, that's fine. That's it for now. And we have potions, we have scrolls, and we have food and that. Whatever that's for. I don't know what that's for. Okay, that was good. Good stuff. Let's go. We, I would really like to get into the other one. Apparently I'm in combat. Hopefully we can find a key for the advan- Oh. As you step inside the cave, you hear the door closing behind you. Oh, Groas, Groas. Hello, Oyo the Shaman. You hear strange, soft murmuring from in front of you, and you see an old shaman mumbling incantations over a pentacle. He stops as he sees you and beckons you. Step closer, stranger. I'll not hurt you. Oh, it's this guy. Hello. Greetings, stranger. Who are you? Yes, fool stranger. You see it right. I'm not an apparition. I'm real. I'm Oyo. Personal good friend of the robber's leader. You just interrupted my private ceremony here, just like somebody else last night. But you can cool my anger. Before you would be so foolish as to attack me, just take a look at the mirrors here and see what powerful allies I have. If you show me respect, I'll tell you what I'm doing here and how you can leave this place. Okay? As I said, go look at the mirrors. Okay. So I can attack him or show him respect, right? Okay. Interesting. You see a beautiful and powerful magician woman in the mirror. Dressed in ornamental cloaks, she's looking right into your eyes and pointing at you with her magic wand. Oh! Oh. Eh? Eh? Hello? Okay, that's disturbing. You see a vapor, breathing on dead creature in the mirror, an ancient ghost of a dead body dressed in blood, red shards, the rotten mouth opens wide, the blind eyes focusing on you. I wonder, I'm wondering, he's, he's head, he's friends with the robber leader, but why would he be killing all the robbers then? You see a strange creature in the mirror. It looks like one big living sphere with a large hypnotizing eye in the middle, looking right into your eyes. You feel dizzy. Is there another one over here? Yes, indeedy do da. You see a living skeleton in the mirror with his dress and helmet and boots, holding an ancient shield and a rusty sword in his bone hands. Okay. I guess that was it, so we'll talk to him now. So you've seen what you had to see, and you know how powerful I am. These are my mighty and majestic allies from the other plane. They await my orders. All I need are a few items to complete my ceremony to call them here. If you help me in this, I'll give you the most ancient and effective power of all. Magic. So stranger, what do you say as you stand at the gate of your death? Live as a chosen one, or die like a rat. Go to hell and kiss your minion's ass. <laughs> Uh, do I, don't I already know magic? Um, he's friends with a robber, so I guess I should try and... I mean, I'm, an, I'm a good guy, so should I try and kill him? Yeah, let's try and kill him, I guess. Sure. Wrong choice. I, I don't know, am I gonna really regret this? Probably. Probably. I do have stone skin. What was that? Ow! Okay. Um. Weird. I'm gonna need, like. I need resists. I don't have any of those. Resist poison. Curse! Detect mind. I need to heal, though. I do. I need to heal first. Okay, he cursed me. That's fine. 
I'll spend this turn uh, detecting mind. Level 14? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Um. How about... Magic missile! Rah! Uh. Anything else? How about... Resist magic, that's what I need. Yes. There we go. That'll that'll help a lot. Okay, and then we'll keep doing magic missile. Except he resisted it, so that's not so good. Stop cursing me. <coughs> Ow. Oh god. I don't know if I'm gonna win this. I have my doubts. Oops, I should've healed. Ow. Oh god. Healing! Stop that! I need to... Uh, any hands? No. Mana. Ow. That's... Ugh. Excuse me, sir. I do need you to die, please. He's half dead. Can I live? Can I actually do this? Ah, oh, crap. Don't resist. That's annoying. Dang it. Stop casting that on me. Okay. Well, I'm out of that now. Um, this is not going well. Not at all. I need to not stop cursing. Um, curse you. I don't think that'll do much. Shield might help me. This might be a stronger burning hands. Let's try it. Ah, oh, he freaking completely resisted it. Dang it. I can still hurt him even though I have curse. I think I can do this. You know what? Actually. Four to six. Six to eight. Four to eight. Let's get. Let's do poison. Poison arrows. Take that. Take that. Take that. Yay! As Oyo slumps to the ground, you notice a curious-looking scroll clutched to his hands. Your light weapon and alchemy skills have been increased. You can spend the available points on your attributes. Yes, 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 yes. I think I forgot to level up last time, actually. Town portal. Nice. Great lightning bolts. Nice. Definitely saving that. Okay, well, we killed this guy, so what happens to all his, like, undead people and things? I don't know! Uh, day four, day four, day three. Let's save over the garden, I guess. Yes? Okay! <laughs> well, let's call that an episode, everybody! Is there any secrets? I feel like there should definitely be a secret, even though he did give me a scroll of... You know. Actually, now that he's dead... Can I go in his portal and... I don't... I guess that doesn't do anything. Alright, well... Oops. Don't see any secrets. Secrety secrets of secretness. Okay. Now, what I want to try and do... Oh, what? I can't go backwards? Oh. Well, that was well, that's why I got the town portal scroll. So there is still a place in here uh, with, you know, the advanced storeroom or whatever that I really want to unlock. Um, but we're going to have to go back around the long way to do that. I would like to level up Disarm and Lockpick as much as I can. I don't know if that's going to be enough to like actually do it, but you know. 
Main skills is gonna be intelligence. And then uh, dexterity. That's good. I assume those are the base stats. And yeah. All right. That will be the episode, everyone. I'll see you next time on the quest where we go back to town and make more monies. And then we embark on a new quest <laughs> inside the quest. A quest in a quest, in a quest in another quest. And yeah, <laughs> thanks for watching.